my science project today, I am going to have five microwaves, and in every one of these cups, there is a certain amount of weebies. And there is a thousand, five hundred, a hundred, ten, and one. So we are going to test and see if the amount of metal makes it so the microwave gets destroyed faster or slower. So to make this as scientific as possible, we have bought five brand new microwaves with the same make and model. All right, so Lincoln, what do you think the difference is gonna be between the one that has one BB in it and the one that has 1,000 BBs? What's your initial thought before we actually test it? So I think that if there is one metal BB inside of the microwave, I think that there is going to take slower to catch on fire or do something that's harming the microwave or have some kind of reaction faster than the one with a thousand. Okay, Lincoln, so do you recommend that other people try this? It sounds kind of dangerous. So I do not think that other people should try remaking this experiment. And we have safety precautions. A fire extinguisher. Just in case anything goes wrong. Uh, oh my god! Oh, fire! Oh my goodness! What's the procedure? Yeah! Let's see what happens when we put metal in the microwave. So the first amount of metal that we're going to put in is one. So let's start off small and go bigger. There's just one metal BB in there. No metal BBs in there. Oh! Yeah. That one escaped. So we set the timer for 10 minutes, and we are going to see how long it goes. So, are you ready? Here we go, three, two, one. Nothing really Maybe we used the wrong kind of metal. One BB is not doing anything. Let's progressively get bigger. Yeah, nothing's happening over here. I can smell something. All right, stopped it at eight minutes exactly. Okay. Let's open this one up. Ten metal BBs. Okay, do you think ten metal BBs are gonna do anything? No. After the first one, no. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. All right. Don't really. It says it's zinc plated, and it's galvanized. Steel air gun shot. I, I would think steel would work. Yeah, I don't understand. Let's just skip to the to, to the thousand. Yeah. One thousand. It's a lot. It took a very long time to count. Five, four, three, two. How's it going over there, bud? Fancy experiment's not going so well. Uh-uh. We have to get actual metal. All right, so Lincoln's going to need to do some research to find out why the steel balls are not interacting with the microwave. Maybe you guys know, you can let us know in the comments. All right, well, that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> I think we need to change it up a little bit here. Yeah. Let's do one, let's do number of spoons or silverware or something. One spoon, two spoon, three spoon, four spoon, five spoon. Yeah, let's try it. These BBs do not do anything and yeah, it took forever yeah. for him to count. All right, put them in. We got five. Five metal spoons. Three, two, one. I think this experiment is turning less into a scientific experiment and more into let's blow something up. <laughs> no, it's and that's not, not what we're here for. It's not what doing what we expected. Well, that's what science is all about. You make a hypothesis, you test it, and you see what happens. And this this didn't meet our hypothesis. Let's try 
That's a good thing. Wait, Maybe microwave these days. Can we try different, one, one of like a bigger spoon? Like a one that, there's five spoons in there. So we kind of need to go to tin foil. Okay, put it in, don't start it. Same thing for all of them. Yeah. Actually, the first one, the first one's tiny. Hi. Good as Paul for you. <laughs> okay. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh. Oh, no. We killed the breaker. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Too much power. We got one little spark and the whole thing went down. <laughs> so what I thought as my hypothesis was actually incorrect, but that's why we do scientific experiments to see if it will do the way that you think it will or if it won't. Just because our microwaves did not have any flames or get destroyed in any way, it doesn't mean that you should go and put metal in your own microwave. It is very dangerous. Put everything in there. Is this what you expected to happen? No. Blue lightning? The strange smell? Oh! So, so it's been going for six minutes. We've just seen some blue lightning. It's been a great fireworks show at the end. Wait, wait, wait. Is this a second science experiment with blue lightning? All right, so uh, there's Lincoln's science experiment. This is, I would say, the most dangerous science experiment that I will allow him to do. Um, luckily, oh. Make noise now. Pi we have a giant pile of brand new microwaves. I think we're gonna go on to the local classifieds and give these ones that we didn't ruin away for free. It's still alive, it's still doing the blue lightning. Yep. Um, yeah, there's a random uh, Sunday night science experiment. Now Lincoln gets to go and write it all up and uh, write what he found and learned. Yeah!